Hello ladies and gentlemen, Nick here. This is a 21st birthday present haul. I say haul. Uh, just basically presents I got on my 21st birthday. Um, which is May 21st, 2020. Nice. So, without further ado, first of all, just some, uh, first of all, just this, uh, badge. 21st birthday badge. I did wear it for a few, uh, for about a minute or two for some picture taking. But it's quite big and uh, I'm wearing a, um... Uh, shirt, a, a shirt that it would that the badge would cover quite a lot of. Plus, it's quite a big badge. Addition, alongside that, I got some jelly babies. Ooh, lovely, jubbly, and some cards. That is with some cards. I got some money uh, from two grandmothers, one hundred from one grandmother, and two thousand from another. Both in checks, but I will not be showing you those due to the fact that well, I expect um, if they were shown. Some people could probably easily write down the numbers and stuff uh, and information and could copy it. So that's basically stealing. So I'm not going to give them that satisfaction of tr attempting to. So you will not be see seeing the, the checks or of money in this video and all the cards there downstairs. But you can see these presents. So the 21st birthday and the jelly babies, that the badge, I mean, are uh, ones that weren't wrapped. The rest were wrapped. First of all, we have a great shirt here. Uh, two great shirts. Sorry about this. Uh, by the way, you might have noticed that uh, Doc 2 cushion pillow. Um, that was actually a present from last year's, uh, from last year, from my 20th. So here we have the Angels Take the Phone Box t shirt in white uh, with blue text. It actually looks really cool. Uh, this is, of course, a quote from the Doctor Who episode Blink from 2007. If you've been watching my retro channel reviews, you'd know. Um, what my thoughts on this um, this store particular story is, and alongside that, I got a second shirt. From um, the first shirt was from my sister. This shirt's from my parents, and this is basically an Abbey Road style with the with four doctors. We managed to guess three of them, which three were. Of course, we got the fourth doctor coming out of the TARDIS, the tenth doctor at the on the end, and the seventh doctor in the middle. But we couldn't work out the other one. We theorised it could be the first Doctor, possibly it could be the ninth, looking at it, actually those shoes look very ninthy. If it's going in some sort of order, it could be five or six, if it's going in order from youngest to oldest Doctor, it could be the ninth Doctor, actually looking at it, um, or the first. Um, take your guess, um, I'm thinking now looking at it properly, it could be the ninth Doctor, Christopher Exton, the others being Tom Baker, Sylvester McCoy and David Tennant, of course. Okay, um, so that this shirt was from my uh, parents and the other one was from my sister. Also from my sister um, was this magic mug, which is actually a Star... Oh, sorry about the phone flap. A Star Wars mug that... Um, a heat up one. I got one of these for Christmas 2017, 16 or 17. Um... Yeah, but apparently it got broken. So I've got a new one uh, here. Um, some nice lightsabers from the prequel and original trilogy films and the Clone Wars TV series. Um, sadly, it does not have the lightsabers from the, se from the sequel films, apart from the Luke Anakin one, which was used by Rey, of course. But no... Um, Kylo Ren lightsaber, no Princess Leia lightsaber, no new yellow lightsaber, and also uh, not the new, uh, no black lightsaber, which was apparently in the uh, one of the TV series. Maybe one of those characters listed might have been from Rebels, actually, on that um, mug. But no yellow lightsaber, no black lightsaber, no white lightsaber, which I think there might be of. The, is there an orange one out there? I'm not quite sure. I did see a video about how there was seven lightsabers, and that was before episode nine, uh, nine came out, which may have introduced the yellow saber, it may have introduced that either that was a new one, or that was one of the other seven, and only four of them had appeared in the films. What well, I say, the other seven, the three that hadn't appeared in the films. Um, but yeah, got that from my sister, so that was great. Uh, got this from my um, uh, aunt, uncle and cousin, um, maternal, um, so mum's uh, sister um, and her husband uh, son basically and it's a Royal Mint James Bond coin with the Aston Martin DB5 and an 07 this is a 
really um really nice package set apparently there's it's the first of three presents coming up so yeah but the other two aren't out then i'm getting those in june and july apparently according to a card um from, oh, sorry about that i'm trying to do this all in one take because i can't edit at the moment um but anyway apparently getting two more maybe or two other presents at least but certainly got a really nice set here um you know i might just i'll just put that away afterwards i'm done and also from and from finally from my parents um i've got the 11 the, sorry the war doctor sonic screwdriver credited as the other doctor sonic screwdriver on the packaging and Star Wars Episode Nine: The Rise of Skywalker Blu-ray and Doctor Who Complete 12 Series Steelbook Blu-ray. Um, this particular is one I was the one I was hoping to get the most because it's the latest Doctor Who series on Blu-ray in Steelbook. So it's great to see that. Now there are some things I was hoping to get that I haven't got yet, but with money, 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 as Apple would say, um, that is not um, might it might not stay that way. We might well I say what, what am I saying? Um, I mean, I might be able to get those maybe at a later point or ask really nicely. But, yeah, so that's basically the birthday haul this time around. Um, at the moment, I do have some bad news to you guys. Um, at, down, on Saturday, I had some problem with my editing software, so I had to get rid of it. And it was a free version of Premiere Pro, but now in order to uh, get it again, uh, get it again, I have to e I have to, we have to pay for it, basically, for a proper subscription, so... Yeah, at the moment we haven't. So at the moment, I haven't been doing any uh, video editing um, recently because I had that problems, and we have to, we'll have to sort something out. Um, maybe try to have try the seven day trial to see if it goes back, if it's a back to normal version, or if it's still having the same problems. And if that's successful, whether we should get the full version or if we should get a completely different software. Um, but that's a decision for another time. Um, but in the meantime, this is the presents I've got here, and yeah, it was a pretty great birthday. Um, well, at that time recording, it's nearly three o'clock, so it's been a pretty great birthday so far. And we had a nice lunch outside, and I had lots of great messages from pe people on Facebook and a few on Twitter as well. And some messaging, some messaging, well, I say, well, one messenger, one or two, well, one of them was my uh, mum, who is also saying it face to face, uh, but. Another one on, on Messenger. Um, the phone messaging, that is a couple people on the Facebook Messenger. But anyway, that's the birthday haul for my 21st. And uh, yeah, it was a pretty great birthday. Supposedly, there's going to be maybe two more things from Aunt and Uncle. Maybe two more of these coin things yet to come. And maybe I'll be able to get some of other things I was hoping to get. Um, with the money, money, money. <laughs> I can't resist. Um but yeah, also a uh, shout out to Ollie Pajak as I will as I filmed a bit for his upcoming Destiny of the Daleks review sketch. Um, his review of Des Destiny of the Daleks, the first story of Doctor Who season 17. When that comes out, go check it out. And I'll be in the sketch playing Romana 1 as it's going to feature, spoiler alert, Romana's regeneration. And about time too. It's about time someone made that. <laughs> so it's a good job it's me and Ollie. It's just, well, Ollie, but I get to play Romana 1 regenerating into Romana 2. So, yeah, be on the lookout for that, and I have to say thank you for him for a, a great op uh, um, opportunity to uh, appear. And yeah, hope you guys are all okay, and have a have a nice day under certain conditions. Um, goodbye.